Today we'll do a short video how to change the rear lights on your Freelander 2, also called LR2 in some regions. Now you, it may just be you've got a damaged light, it may be you need to change the bulbs, you need to remove the, the light, or you may want to upgrade to the new LED lights. Tom, can you open the boot and offer the new light up against the old one so people can get an idea while we're doing this? So in 2012 they facelifted and if you put that one next to that one you can see the, the difference there. So you've got the, the later light there Tom's holding against the earlier light and we'll, we'll do a video after this one showing you how to fit that and connect the electrics up. Okay so back to the main task, thank you Tom, um, is how to remove this. So I'll pass the camera over to Tom. Fairly straightforward, so you've got two screws here with a cross head, one here and one here. So we'll just spin those out. There's one. Okay, they're both the same. And the second one, Tom will show you the state of this car we've got in the workshop today. This car is absolutely stinking. But Luckily for us, he's happy to let us play with his rear lights. So there's the second screw we've got out. Now, what you've got, I'll show you on the on this this other light here, is you've got these two little um, nipples, for want of a better word, on the on the far side here. So you can either give it a pull sharply backwards. Let me get out your way there, Tom. Sorry. You can either give it a pull sharply backwards. Well, what you can do is get one of these sort of plastic wedge tools, okay, and just push that in slightly. And what I did, what I normally do is just lever it out from this side and lever against. So rather than levering with the, the plastic tool, just use it to rest against and then just, just pull it out like so. Okay, so there you go. You can see again the nipples and you can see the little docking stations that they fit into one there and one down there, that's it. Okay, so you've got a connector here and this is the standard type of automotive connector where you've got a little bit you have to push here to release and then give it a, a pull, okay, and that releases the connection there. Now, if you were just putting on a new one, just plug in the new light and push it in. Uh, that's the end of this video. We'll do a next video which will show you how to upgrade to the LED light.